everyone and welcome back to the channel hope you're having a beautiful evening a swell old time hope that january is treating you well am i getting like tan oh my god i can see my tan i've been doing a lot of jogging don't know if you kind of anyways all right so <laughs> let's go ahead and uh let's go ahead and run through our long song saturday preview for february 2023 we got off to a good start of january hope that it was a good start for you guys but now it is time to dig ourselves into the year a little bit with our long song Saturday schedule. Of course, you're more than welcome to leave your recommendations, your suggestions, and all of that stuff down in the comments below, uh, which all of these have been taken from. I have snatched up each of these four long song Saturdays from you guys directly, so I hope that you're looking forward to it. And without further ado, let's go ahead and get into it, starting with February 4th. Uh, this track has been recommended by GOG. San Andinson, Ricardo Pizzighello, Cujo Cujo, K Fleetwood, Pulsar 77, Zen Clover, and genuinely the list just endlessly goes on. Actually, it does end right here. <laughs> M Silverthorpe, Master of Parsnips, the list goes on a little bit. Anyways, we are going to listen to the, I think it's the first track off this album. Yeah, the first track off of this 1976 album, Presence. Led Zeppelin, that will be the track Achilles Last Stand. So many of you guys have been asking for this track for years, and actually looking back at it, I see that the earliest recommendation that I can find was from two years ago. So, uh, yeah, this one has been a long way coming, a long train coming, and finally arriving at the station. So, February 4th will be Led Zeppelin with Achilles Last Stand. Hope you're looking forward to it. The next week, February 11th, we're going to take a turn. We're going to take a twist. We're going to take a little diversion. We're going to explore a little more classical music. Mm -hmm. We've been slowly dabbling and incorporating a little bit of that in here. So last time when we were listening to The Planets and Holst, uh, I saw a few recommendations for this piece. And I said, well, let's give it a, let's give it a listen. As a matter of fact, let's give it a watch because we're going to watch a live performance of it. We are going to watch this performance that has been recommended by D.B. King, Pentagrammaton, Diogenes, Diogenes Agogo, Karen Pugh, and Cat Dub, and the list goes on in here as well. We're going to watch this live performance up. Oh, I just lost it of uh, the Lark Ascending. Ralph Vaughn Williams. We're going to watch the live performance, including and perhaps starring Hilary Hahn. Uh, there's a live video of that on YouTube, and that is what we're watching and listening to. So once again, you got a little rock in the mix. You got a little classical in the mix. You get your Honey in your peanut butter, and you get something, a honey nutter. Moving on to February 18th. This album has been long recommended, especially by one particular person, but by many as well, as well. A uh, big shout out to George Blasco, because he has been asking for this for, for a long time. And I told him, I said, I'm going to get to it. I'm going to get to it. Uh, but alongside with Mr. Blasco, like me, and I see that you rec recommended this album as well, Dave White, Mario Burt. John Smith, Ian Coleman, Richard Karbowski, and the list goes on, Paul. Um, Ariadne, I see you got here too. Um, we're going to take the first side, I don't know, let me pull it up, of this 1985 album, Misplaced Childhood by Marillion. Woo! Some of you have been really looking forward to this one. George especially. George has really been the, the, the front runner, the campaign leader of this particular album, and happy to bring it to you, happy to give it a listen Happy to go ahead and explore that. So that will be on February 18th. Finally, you see I didn't hold too much tension. Like I kind of quickly got into this one, right? Like I don't want to belay the point overall like I'm doing right now. I wanted to give a little bit of immediacy. Okay, February 25th. We are also going to take another first side. We're going to listen to another first side. This time uh, a 1968 album. Who's recommended this one? Quite a few of you actually. Schuler Southwell, Paul Hansberry. I.B. Eddy, Insane Brain, Mort, Mort Horon, some of these names, I'm telling you. Dalt992, Happily Eggs, Altair. Once again, the list goes on. Greg Davis, I see you there. Crimson King 70, Harrow Blaze. Listen, there's a lot of you because I didn't even scroll near halfway through. We're going to listen to the first side of the 1968 album from the Moody Blues, In Search of the Lost Chord. This is one that you guys had recommended but also voted on in my video that I made, what, last month? Choose the next Moody Blues album. This is what you chose. So this is what we're doing. It's the people's choice. You can't go wrong. <laughs> so in finality, 
we have Led Zeppelin, Achilles, Last Stand, Hilary Hahn, Ralph Vaughn Williams, The Lark Ascending, Marillion, Misplaced Childhood, Side 1, and then The Moody Blues, In Search of the Lost Chord, Side 2. So out of these four, out of these four, I hope there's something that kind of tickles you. <laughs> Kind of tickles your fancy hopefully there's something in there that you like something that you're looking forward to uh, i'm looking forward to all of it otherwise i wouldn't have chose it but <laughs> otherwise like i said let me know your thoughts on what has been chosen let me know what you suggest for uh upcoming future long song saturdays as well and besides that everyone enjoy the rest of your day thank you for being here i'll see you all on the flip side which who even knows what that means don't think too hard about it bye guys